What you're looking at in this video is me using an orbital sander. What I want to talk about is the practical steps involved in the decision making that I underwent while doing this so that if you have a physical disability and you have the urge to do some woodworking, you might make it a possibility. So first off, with the orbital sander, and there's many other tools, I want to point out that it's cordless. Now I realize there's a higher cost to these tools, but not having the cord to trip on, not getting it tangled up in your wheelchair, or whatever you need to sit on, and then the ability to set up your workstation as you need have worked out really really well for me as well you can see throughout this clip how i just slightly reposition my power wheelchair while i'm going about the sanding what i'm focused on is not stressing my knees and my hips this is working and has worked really well as I've spent the time sanding this frame. Now, I want to talk a minute about pacing yourself. The battery on the, on the orbital sander only lasts for about 20 minutes and then it needs to be charged. So it's easily enough forcing you into pacing yourself so that you're not overstressing yourself. Like I've often talked about it being better to spend 20 minutes doing something and have a break, you know, than spending 35 minutes and experiencing pain for the next six hours. And the other part of it is just being able to take your time and actually be able to enjoy yourself and the sense of fulfillment that comes along with this. It's not particularly hard to operate the orbital sander. There are other tools as well. I just want to get you thinking that if you have the urge to, to make something that you might consider doing it, or doing as much as you're capable yourself, and then having someone who's able body or who has other skills than you finishing it off. It kind of amounts to having the mindset of wanting to do something and then pursuing it and having enough courage and common sense to ask for help once the need arrives. That's kind of what I wanted to share while this video uh, played. I hope you're doing well and you know, when the, when the weather warms up where you're at, I encourage you to get outside, even if it's just to sit on your balcony so you can enjoy the warmer weather and, you know, and take part in life. Have a wonderful day. Bye for now.